We're going to take a quick look today at Banner Snack and maybe what we call a short tutorial. Bannersnack.com, you want to go there if you are not familiar with Banner Snack. It's a good way to create, well, banners and different graphics without having to hire a graphic designer. So we use it. Uh, go sign up if you want to sign up for an account. Once you have an account, you go to my workspace. And as you can see, we've already got about 10 things we've worked on. And we're going to go through here and look. You see the Create New button if you want to create a new uh, graphic. Let me turn off George, who's wanting to chat. So we have Spotify banners. We've done Facebook banners, uh, Facebook banners announcements, YouTube banners, avatars, uh, social media posts. It's good for a variety of different, uh, creating different size graphics for the to meet the needs of uh, the specs of all the platforms. So we're going to look at this one that we've created. We use this for a Facebook post, and uh, there are templates over on the left that uh, for different categories, automotive, health, holidays, you know, if you're in uh, any type of business or uh, you just have a Facebook page that you like to, uh, that has a theme, you can make and find some themes here with templates already created. Uh, that'll save you some time. Uh, we're going to look at backgrounds uh, on this particular design. We just have a black background, but you can resize. Let's look at this. You can resize your images or you can pick these presets like uh, whatever Facebook requirements are. Uh, YouTube, uh, several other social media platforms where you can just instantly select that. Or you can customize the size of your graphic here and uh, change that. And uh, we'll go back to backgrounds. We have a black background, but you can go to gradients and uh, choose different ones of those. Or you can add texture backgrounds. So those are available. Or you can go to images and search a particular uh, image that you may like or just use the stock images that they have. Let's go to text. You can have a nice heading, subheading, body of text, or these cool pre-designed text that you can add. We have several text box here, and you see the uh, the uh, menu for changing font, size, color, add drop shadow if you want to. Uh, again, changing the color. All of those types of features for once you get your text box in place and type in your text for whatever you want to say on your graphic. Place it, move it, drag it uh, wherever you want. Let's go to elements. We've uploaded several of our own elements or photos, images that we use. Uh, you can also go to the uh, stock images, like there's stock photos available on Banner Snack. Uh, you can search a particular theme, like let's look at mountains and see what comes up. So there's quite a few images for mountains that you can already use in your uh, graphic. There's also some other little things like buttons uh, that you can add if you're making a post about downloading something, sub subscribing or signing up if you need just a generic button. On the right is your layers. You can move those to uh, order the hierarchy of the layers. And if you want to save it, what you've done, you can save it to JPEG, JPEG PNG, uh, several options there. Uh, we're using the free version. Uh, you can also upgrade to the pro version, which gives you a lot more options as you can see. Uh, to work with, but that is kind of the overview of Bannersnack at bannersnack.com. Thanks for watching.